Well, Brandon, it took you guys some time to kind of settle in tonight, but how would you kind of assess the performance overall? Uh, I think we did a lot of good things, but we did a lot of bad things as well. Um, just got to tighten them up in practice. Schwartz talked about defensively, he wasn't pleased with the effort. Uh, is that kind of the thing you hit on most after the game? Yeah, for sure. Defense, rebounding, uh, just effort in general. I mean, we, uh, we didn't give our best effort. As a foul trouble was something we talked about last year for you, but today you know, you're pretty relatively clean. I mean, what, what was that process like, kind of getting there and just being able to play the game the way you like to play? Um, just staying out of foul trouble, uh, just being disciplined. Uh, that's the biggest key for me, just staying disciplined on defense, not gambling, and defense. And just being, being disciplined. <laughs> How hard is it, Ezra, to go out there Game one, like you, I know you probably tell yourself, like, stay calm, but then you get out there and under the lights, like, is it hard to do that? Um, nah, I don't, I don't got too much butterflies. I'm confident, you know, the people around me, same team from last year, so we we're already coming in confident. Uh, you know, we wasn't at our best tonight, but trust me, when time come, we're gonna be ready. Is it a good thing, Brandon? You win by 30, but still feel like you got a lot to clean up like is that kind of a, a, a blessing in disguise i guess yeah for sure it's always good to win a win is a win but like uh like you said we'll we'll come and practice and clean everything up and like you said we'll be ready when it's all done brandon just uh you know how important are these early games you know with some new guys you know different rotations just kind of getting a feel of how guys play together oh uh, very important um, uh we had two scrimmages but like we actually got to lace them up in front of fans and like get a good atmosphere, get a good feeling of how it's going to be throughout the year, and we'll continue to grow on that. Take it, you took the ball off the bounce a lot more tonight, Brandon. Yeah. Was that you know part of the you know try, trying to elevate your game this off season for you a yeah, little yes, bit? Yes, sir, for sure. Uh, like me, yeah, as we'll be rebounding and go all season, so you'll see a lot of. It. Question for you: there, You both shot ten free throws. Did it kind of get you calmed down? Field the games, you have to line so um, again, another challenge for us this season is to sh get to the line and, and create foul trouble um, for other players. Uh, that just comes from being aggressive, and we're going to be aggressive all season long. So, trust me. Ezra got asked about the purple hair, man. How, um, how did that come about? <laughs> I just wanted to try a different style in school spirit. So, I like it. Everybody else loves it. If you don't love it, you still rocking it. So, <laughs> I'm ready to ball out, though. Do you keep it going all season, or is it kind of a to be determined thing? You never know. I'm a, I'm a picky guy, so I'm you know very detailed about how I look, what I wear. So you just never know how long it might last in my hair, but I like it. Brandon, you want to follow suit with your purple hair? Stand yeah, regular. We're we gonna dye hair purple next week. <laughs> Stand regular. Stand regular like I am.